Yeah, what was it like to uh, make them make that big catch there at the end of the Clemson game and be able to not necessarily put the game away, but get a big moment where you can actually convert there? Um, it was big, especially for the offense. Uh, the team needed it. I'm glad I can be there for the team uh, to show up. Uh, at a crucial time, we need to put the game away. I'll ask you too, what did you think when you first uh, saw those comments by Coach towards Steve Smith? Uh, I, was, I laughed at it actually, but it was kind of funny because I never seen him doing that before. But um, I'm glad he did that. It's good to have a coach that has your back and stand up for you because we're a family, so we stand up for each other. You struggled a little bit um, with consistency this season. You know, what did it mean to you to have some of those big receptions this weekend? Uh, it meant a lot. Um, not having as many targets as I have had last year, uh, it definitely meant a lot. But uh, you get targeted ball, but just playing fast and playing free. Uh, make some catches, contact catches was a big thing for me. It gave me a lot of um, boosted energy, whatever, confidence, booster. It was good for me. Man. You guys huddled for the entire game. How different was that? Uh, that was real different for me. But, yeah, that was different because I never actually been a part of a team, uh, offensive huddle like that. And you got to run out to the ball and stuff. So it was kind of uh, energy consuming, but it was all right. I enjoyed it. Um, it was a good game plan by Coach and I. And I feel like it worked out well. Do you think it was a, a change up that was just needed something different, especially with Clemson expecting you guys to? Come out and, and uh, just line up the way you've been doing before. Yeah, it was kind of a change, like at the right time, because they didn't, definitely didn't know we were going to be doing it. I think no one knew we were going to be doing that. So it definitely was a good change, and we can shock the other team. So it worked out not being a bit. So. What's it been like for you to see you know, Casey you know, have the, the freshman year just have so far? Oh, I'm, I'm glad to see him doing what he's doing. He has a bright future. I feel like the coaches do a, a really good job putting him in positions to be successful. I feel like he has a bright year here, I mean, a bright future here at NC State. And he's definitely. Um, did what he's supposed to do. Well, I, well, I, well, I thought he was going to do for the jump. He always he came in with a lot of energy and a lot of excitement, so I knew he was going to be a fighting player, fighting player. How much are you guys as a wide receiving core trying to work to you know, to be that that next guy, to be the guy that's able to take pressure off of him, but also make those big catches as well? Uh, it's kind of just like take advantage, take advantage of the opportunity. Um, whenever the ball gets to you, uh, you never know when the ball can get to you. Um, kind of like go through their reads and then they get the ball coming to you, you got to go to play. So. Whenever you get your opportunity, you just got to be there and be ready and take advantage of your opportunity. Last one. There's, there's a lot of receivers playing right now. What's the competition like, you know, just in the, in the receivers' room? Just, you know, uh, there's a lot of competition. There's also a lot of encouragement. We encourage each other. We also um, know that we, in the outside room, need to, need to play a lot better. I feel like we stepped up a lot. Uh, and we've just been encouraging each other, staying, staying close to each other, uh, working hard in practice. A lot of things we're working on in practice is talking to each other. Like, when we do stuff wrong, like, just to boost each other up. Give each other more confidence and have us play faster than that.